Hi, my name is Ryan Westmoreland, and I would like to wish Barrow Neurological Institute a happy 50th anniversary. Thank you for saving my life. My pretty much life with baseball started as far back as I can remember. Um, my dad was always my coach. Um, I always loved the game, you know, from t-ball on and as the years went on I kind of knew that's what I wanted to do and that was my real true love is was being out on the field having teammates you know and just loved playing the game overall. Becoming a prospect for the Boston Red Sox obviously was a dream come true. Uh, I was preparing for spring training and you know I felt great and um, swing felt great, throwing felt great, pretty much every aspect of my game felt as though it, it never had and I felt stronger and bigger and more ready to play than I had ever been. So one random day, I uh, started to feel some tingling in my fingertips. It was very similar to if you just hand fell asleep. So, you know, I didn't think anything of it and kind of just played through it. When I really noticed something was wrong, um, I remember this day pretty, pretty easily. Um, we were do outside doing just some jogging and stretching and uh, I felt a really weak sensation feeling in my whole right side, right arm and right leg. Um, so that's when I knew something wasn't right. What I was diagnosed with was called a cavernous malformation. Um, it's a, pretty much a series of blood clots in the brain. and We were all kind of in shock, my family and I. We were referred by a couple of people to Dr. Robert Spetzler, who was at Barrows. And, um, he was really the only guy that, without any hesitation, said, you know, I'm very comfortable doing this surgery. There are risks, but I'm fully confident in, of my capabilities to do it. And, you know, I would, I would perform it right now if I could. And I said, you know, I trust this guy. Um, we're going to go out. And sure enough, one or two days later, we flew out to Phoenix. Oh, it was, of course, a very scary time for everybody, but how Dr. Spetzler displayed his confidence and, you know, his optimism was, was beyond what we expected in such a tough, a tough time, and that's really what we all needed. I went from the point after surgery where I couldn't throw a ball 10 feet to now I'm throwing about 120 feet with, with good velocity, and I'm swinging the bat and live pitching. I'm pretty much doing pretty close to everything any other professional baseball player is doing, which is, is huge for me. I feel that it's important to support Barrows just based on, you know, the respect that they give not only their patients, but their patients' families and everyone, everyone around them. And really the only thing I could say to them is, thank you, you saved my life, which is the 100% truth. I mean, if I didn't get the, the treatments there, the, you know, the care, the respect, it, none of this could have been possible. And... I wouldn't be where I am now without him. And um, just one huge thank you, and you know, thank you for saving my life.